Look at this beauty. This is an absolutely beautiful puzzle. So many different pieces of wood used in making this. Um, this is just like the most fun looking puzzle I've seen in a long time. This puzzle is known as the Castle Builder Set. The object is to build a path from top to bottom that doesn't require jumping. Now you might ask yourself what jumping is real quick. I do have a diagram. So basically at the start, you got to arrange the castle. Now each of these pieces, each of these pieces has a small number, like this one's 35. So I've placed them from one to 35, kind of like this, all the way down here. And each of them has a small little square, just like that. So it says here you can't jump. Uh, if you look at the red arrows, that's jumping. You got to take the stairs and you can't move in diagonal. You have to have a clear path. Two is you have to rearrange the pieces by sliding them around. And three, once you're done, once you've reached the top, you can actually change the castle and build your own and then start right over. And that's why this is a super fun puzzle. This puzzle's from Pelican, um, Thomas Vanyo, Tamas Vanyo. This puzzle was crafted in Europe with absolutely fantastic quality. Each of the puzzles of Pelican design are unparalleled in their class. They really are. Every piece of the puzzle is precisely cut and very well made. You can't find its equal anywhere else because they are so unique. And the diversity in wood makes each puzzle such a unique masterpiece. I mean, that is beautiful. Sitting on the shelf, a little castle like this, but it also looks like a children's game, which is cool too. So here we go. I've got my morning coffee. I've got this puzzle. I am all alone. And hopefully we can get to the end. Now again, the goal is to slide pieces so that you see these little stairs here. Hard to see on that side. I'll try to keep it angled over here. Well, these stairs need to lead up to this spire. That's the goal. So here we go. Should we put up a timer? I think we should put up a timer. Start, stopwatch. Got a bit of a timer going here. All right. I have to get up there. Now we got stairs here. We got platforms. It's not super easy to maneuver all the pieces. Little stairs here. Need to connect them to at least another little platform or another set of stairs, kind of like this. See, these ones go sideways, so that's not going to work. Now, ah, now we've made like a little platform. Um, but how does that really help us? Just move the spire out of the way. Got a little path here now. You can see that? A little path here. If we could get, we need stairs. Actually, if we can get this one here, it might actually help us out a bit. But how?
pieces do tend to get stuck quite a bit, but it isn't so bad. Could be worse. Okay. Now this is quite significant. So let's start <laughs> trying to lose track of what we're doing here. Uh, we got the stairs here. And as you can see, it moves on to a bit of a platform there. And then over here, we've got stairs going up more. Okay, so we've created this small path, but we've got to we've got to have another platform here. Oh, I can actually push this guy in. This is actually great. There we go. Now this small path uh, leads into this tiny spire. Uh, the tiny spire can lead onto a platform but then that's pretty much it because it can't hop on these stairs like this. So I'll need, uh, I'll need stairs that face the other way. Hmm. I don't want to undo what I've already done, but I feel like I must. Hold on. Oh, it's actually so close. If I could simply get that one out of the way. See how these stairs here lining up, but they're not, they're sort of adjacent to this entrance, but I need them to go into that entrance. Um, so I would have to, oh man, this is quite difficult. Okay, that goes there. This is the type of game I could play for a very long time, I feel. And, and not get bored. Because there is uh, multiple solutions and I think a puzzle that has like a lot of solutions but is still hard. I think there's a lot of fun in that because it gives you encouragement to know that if you persevere, you're probably going to end up with one of the multiple solutions. So it's not like I'm trying to look for a single solution. There are probably dozens, if not hundreds of solutions, maybe even thousands. It's all pretty random. So that's, uh, it's really encouraging actually. Okay, hold on. So we're here, here. Spire's now way over there. Where's my gap? It's over here. Oh, this might be good. Hold on. This might be good. This might be good. I'm not there yet, but it, it's getting there. I have to get this one over here. So that once I go up these stairs, I can turn right if I, if I fall onto this platform here.
Boom. Okay, here we are so far. Let's have a look. We've got a path, as you can see, that climbs from here, goes up to here. There's a hole in this tiny spire. And then I move onto this platform. Now from this platform, I can move here as well. I can keep going straight or I can move there as well. There's another path that I can create with that small little ledge. And which way do I want to go? Which is the path of least resistance. We have the spire, which is right here. So let's say I'm here and I can walk along this edge. I can then walk along this edge. Oh, hello. I can then also, come on, come on, fella. Oh, wait, no. Wait, here, come on. Oh no, I can't shift that one because look at the feet. The feet down there are all stuck together, all clamored together. I can't, uh... Huh. Okay. Okay, hold on a second here. Now we've got stairs going up here. We're getting somewhere close. We're getting somewhere close, but I, I'm not close enough. I'm still quite far away. Hmm. I need these stairs. Somehow. That won't move. Oh man. This whole thing seems easy enough until you realize that some of these pieces won't move anymore because of the way their feet are positioned. See, now if I could only bridge the gap between these stairs here, see these stairs, the way they go all the way down here, they don't touch, I'd have to jump here. I'd need a little step to get up there, but then once here, I could probably shift this guy into place and make it to the top of the spire. But for now, I don't know, there's no, uh, there's no path that way. Hold on. Oh no. Ah, the stairs are on the wrong place. You can see the stairs going up here, uh, leading up here, but then um, I'm kind of on a dead end. I can't go diagonally here.
Standing at 15, almost 16 minutes right now. Okay. Okay. Now. Do you see the path? We start here. Right where the steps are. We walk up here, we move up here. We're on here, boom, and now we're up here. We are so close to the top of the spire here, but yet so far. Now I can move this little ledge and get us an extra bit of platform there. If I just shift these tiny ones out of the way. I think like this. Right, now I've created this lovely little platform here. But I'm still not there. And I still haven't found. Oh man, we're so close. We are so close. I'm gonna go into the zone now. Um, I might not talk through this next part because I'm just gonna try and concentrate and get myself out of this predicament. I need this one. I need this one here. How do I get that there? Oh boy, oh boy, there's no getting that there. Wait, there might be. We are so close right now. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh man, so close. Check this out. We go up here, we go here. We go up here, we go here. I need a platform here. And I can get here, 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 and I can get up. Okay, very close. I think I've got it. So close, so close, so close. Gosh, I'm so close.
So right now they're all getting sort of stuck at the feet. I can't move them in the directions I want to move them in and that's uh, incredibly frustrating because I see a path but the path just doesn't doesn't work out. Nope. That doesn't move this way. This doesn't move that way. This one moves this way, but then this one doesn't move that way. Wait, that's it. I got it. Let's go. 36 minutes. Not bad. Let's have a look and double check our homework here. Make sure everything lines up. So we have these small stairs here, which we then climb up. We make our way up these stairs. We have a platform here. We then use this platform to get up here. We now enter the spire through the spire, take the next set of stairs and into the final tower. That is the build builder's castle set solved. That is amazing, so much fun. Oh my God, I can't wait to do this again. This will definitely be a staple in the office. It'll stay on the coffee table, I think. This is definitely replacing the next, the last puzzle that was on the coffee table as being the next uh, fun toy for people to play with. Check out the link below. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video. Peace. Enchanté.